Okay, hey guys. Today we're going to do a video that we haven't done in quite a while. If I can think about it. Yeah, I don't think we've done a video like this in a little minute. Um, this is an empties video, which is basically like, um, should I do empties slash? No, we're going to do two separate videos. This is the empties video. So this is the first time that I've done a video like this. Um, this is basically like stuff that I enjoyed a lot and enjoyed it to the point that it's empty. So, um, yeah, let's jump right into it. Cause I'm gonna keep dazing off in the space. The first thing would be this, um, wet and wild photo focus three in one coconut primer water prep set and refresh. Um, I use this to set and I use this to, um, prime my skin before I even do my makeup. Um, this is really, really good. Um, very affordable. It's only $4.99 at Ulta. I think it's $4.99 at Target as well. The only thing I can say is when it gets towards the bottom, it starts spraying funny. But I realized um, the nozzle that goes down in there, the little spray part, um, it needs to be like dead set over the liquid. So if I turn it around and keep spraying, the spray eventually comes out. So, that's one thing. The next thing, I don't wanna make the video too long, but I am gonna give you like things that I used all the way to the end. The next thing on the list is this, um, the main choice tropical moringa sweet oil and honey endless moisture sealing cream. Um, funny story about why this looks like this. I spent $14.99 on this moisturizer maybe even $16.99 I really can't remember but I got it from my local beauty supply store um going natural is not cheap you guys at all like this I could um do a $60 hairdo and it lasts probably longer than this would no no I don't know but what I'm trying to say is going natural ain't cheap you have to buy all these products to try and maintain a look like see how I got my little swoopies and my little wet and wave yeah that takes time and it takes money like you this lasted me probably like two weeks so let's just say $18 every two weeks because if it was $16.99 then it's $18.01 with 7% sales tax um let's just say 18 and 18 is 36 $36 Oh, this spider trying to get in here. This is a trick of the enemy. I wish y'all could see this spider. Like, away with the Satan. I don't do spiders. Why is this spider all in my space? And he's like, y'all don't believe me. Can y'all see that spider? The spider is like, he trying to get in here so bad like buddy this is not what you want you will die if you get in here go away go away sir <sighs> okay back to the video i'm sorry i was distracted because all you see is like a spider with his little <sighs> death grippers is my window closed i'm gonna be paranoid I need my rate. Look at him. One eternity later. Call himself get through here. I want to be ready for him. So let me put this down here. Okay. Now back to the video. I, um, when it got down to the bottom and no more would come out, I ended up cutting the side, the top off, and then after I couldn't get it that way, I um cut it down the side so I could bend it back and get it to the last drop like there's if you guys can see there's nothing in there like I cleaned it um but yeah this has a very good good smell to it like if you like fruity smell like tropical smell 
Um, this is a good moisturizer. The smell alone did it for me, but um, it also has a lot of good um, hair benefiting things in here. No sulfates, no parabens, no petroleum, no formaldehydes, no mineral oil. So all that is good. Very good, especially if you're going natural. Um, it did what I think it was supposed to do. Help reduce breakage and minimize shedding. Um, helps improve elasticity and manageability. I feel like it did all that. Um, enhances natural sheen, shine, I'm sorry, and luster. Helps strengthen, protect, and replenish nerves. It, it did everything that it said it would do on the front um, and the back. And I would definitely buy it again. But um, I'm trying to see... Excuse me, I'm trying to see what hair brand products is going to work the best on my hair. So, once I figure that out, that's what I'm going to stick with. But I'm trying different things as of yet. This was really good, though. This was really good. Um, the smell. I like smell. I like stuff that makes my hair smell good and, it, like, it works. The next thing... <laughs> Is this the main choice um, heavenly halo herbal hair tonic and soy milk deep hydration softening milk um, this also smelled really good it smelled like marshmallows um, it says daily moisturizing softening milk and that's what you want you want something you can use um, daily as a moisturizer because I have to do my hair every day so um, I need something that I could use on my hair every day and it doesn't like weigh my hair down or overpower my hair. If you guys see my eyes wandering, I'm looking for that spider. Cause I'm telling you if that spider gets in here, I'm not playing with the spider. I should have been watching him. Cause if he come in here, I'm gonna flip everything over in this room I don't see him though so I'm gonna hope and pray that he went back to where he came from the depths of hell but back to this um this was very good um it definitely moisturized my hair um definitely made my hair soft definitely made my hair smell good it says gentle enough to use daily on all hair types I agree with that um definitely didn't make my hair feel weighed down um, I definitely, how many times am I going to say definitely? I really liked how this made my hair feel. Um, yeah, I don't know. I do have a little bit left in the bottom. Like, I will be getting that out, but it's dag near empty. Like, when I pushed down on this earlier, nothing came out, so... That's why I put it in the empties pile. Um, I got that on sale at Target for $10.89. So, that was on clearance. Um, the next thing in the empties pile is this Edge Booster Gel. Why is that gel like that? Edge Booster Gel. Um, this is a Style Factor Edge Booster Gel. And this is in the Sweet Peach scent. I pretty much clean this. I mean, there is a little bit more in there. Excuse me. But it's pretty much clean. Um, I mean, if I like scraped it, scraped it, I could get more. But what made me get this was I saw um, the reviews on it on YouTube. And um, I'm still looking for that spider. I'm sorry. I saw the reviews for it on YouTube and I wanted to see if it was what everybody was saying it was on YouTube. So I went by my beauty supply store and this was $16.99. And um, it lasts a really long time because a little bit goes a long way. Um, it definitely has a strong hold. It says hold, um, hold power five and that's the strongest one that they have. It's a no alcohol formula so that's good because alcohol will break your hair. Um, yeah the smell it smells really good it smells like peaches um other than that it does just what it said it would and it's strong it's strong just like the edge booster the edge control is the edge control is really strong and it does not move as far as i know that's not what i have on my hair today by the way i have um something else on my hair that will be mentioned in another video 
but um i would definitely buy this again the only thing i will say is i bought this and then i bought another gel that'll be mentioned in another video so you have to watch that video to find out what gel it is and um they act pretty much the same so why spend 16.99 when i could spend three dollars and 70 cents and get the same results but this is a good gel i would buy this gel again um probably when i have more money not just to like every week i'm buying it or every two weeks i'm buying it because a big thing of gel normally lasts me like two weeks because i do my hair like every day or like six days out the week but um yeah i'll definitely get this again and lastly but not leastly on the empties column is this elf lip plump and gloss and pink cosmo now when i first got this i said that i actually wanted another color i wanted um peach bellini from the same lip plumping collection and they didn't have any more at the ulta that i was at so i ended up getting this as a second choice and baby let me tell you something god put this in my pathway god made a way for this to be there instead of the peach bellini because this is probably like this turned into my favorite gloss and I actually have to get some more when payday comes up. This right here, this is a goat. Like this can go on my goats column now. This is like one of my favorite glosses. Like it just, it works so good by itself. It works so good as a topper. It's just, it's an all around bomb gloss. And I will definitely, like I'm probably gonna get two or three when I go to Ulta on Thursday and get more. Um, Cause I need to get a variety of makeup but i'll definitely be getting this again this is definitely like creamy and it goes on slick and it's a little the applicator is a little brown because i do um outline with brown liner and then i put this on top but i mean i like the applicator this was the first time i saw a clear applicator and then um i like how it bends on the lip part because it was like contouring to my lip but this, like, I, you guys don't understand. Can you see that the tube is, like, empty? Like, there's nothing in there. I have to scrape to get gloss out of here. That is how much I love this gloss. And I'll definitely be getting, getting it again. The plumping part of this, at first, it bothered me. But um, once I got used to the tingling, it was fine. It was like a, like a peppermint in there that's making it, like, tingle. But... As you can tell, I got big lips. I don't need plumping help in the plump department, but um, I'll definitely be getting it again. I loved, I loved this gloss. This is like one of my favorite glosses at the moment. And so, excuse me, y'all. Um, that's all for this video, empties, the empties video. I do have another video coming up. Hopefully it popped up when I did that just now. I'm a little mad corny. Um, I do have another video coming up where I discuss um, my August slash September favorites. Um, so yeah, stick around for that video and um, follow me on social media, Shyly1990 on Twitter, excuse me, and Snapchat, Shyly1990 Makeup on Instagram and Facebook. Like, comment, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Hit the bell to be notified when I do post videos. And I'll see you guys in the next video.